The Maryville police chief tonight says he's done everything he can, but more than a dozen patrol cars in his fleet will have to be replaced after only a few years old. That decision is going to cost taxpayers thousands of dollars. The chief wrote this letter to the residents of Maryville today explaining they bought 15 Dodge Durango pursuit vehicles during the pandemic because they couldn't get the Fords that they usually rely on. Those Dodge SUVs have had a litany of issues, including engine failure. They're not the first department to witness these issues. Indiana State Police also bought Dodge Durangos in the past few years and also experienced the same catastrophic failures. The chief says they've tried to fix the issue, waited months for the parts from Dodge and reached out to Dodge Stellantis for help, but nothing has worked. I can no longer in good conscience allow these vehicles to be relied upon by my police officers and the public. What if they're racing to a hot call because somebody's in need of trouble, somebody's in need of, of the police. And while we're going there, the vehicle just blows up and shuts down. The motor shuts down to just, it just catastrophic failure shuts down, right? What do we do? We can't get there. We can't get to help these people. He says they'll have to sell those Dodges soon and buy new squad cars, which will cost taxpayers. We've reached out to Dodge Stellantis for comment and have not yet heard back.